The next tool that we will be using is the undercut gauge. Again, this is placed into the chuck. The undercut gauge is placed next to the tooth. It is pulled up slightly until both the stem and the lip are touching the tooth at the same time. Once this position is found, the undercut gauge is moved left to right to make a small scratch into the cast. This is repeated on the other tooth as well. In order to record this, a mark can be made This point is the position where the tip of the clasp will seat. It is only this point that the clasp engages the undercut. As you can see, the undercut marking is in the undercut region.